Yo guys, Teams for Clan, what's up here? And we are back with another video. Um, I'm gonna be starting today with well, basically, what I'm gonna be doing is a tutorial on how to uh, do uh, custom thumbnails for free without like Photoshop or anything using Pixlr. So, uh, when you're on Pixlr, you're gonna type your name of your thumbnail if you want, whatever it is, just, I want to name it that because why not, and then you go 1280 by 720, 720, and then check transparent, and once you have that, I'm going to go to Google. And then, uh, well, you know what, nah, you don't, you can just type any search, but whether really you want to type in what you want. So, I'm just going to do, like, uh, what color background or whatever. So I'm just going to do, like, blue background. Or, like, blue, you know what, I like grunge. Do, those are really nice, so I'm just going to do blue grunge. Um, for the size, you want it bigger than 1280 by 720. So this one right here would work perfectly. Perfect size, no quality loss. So that is exactly what we're going to use. So we're going to go to that. And we are going to find it. And then we're going to open it. And then when we open it, once we have it here, we're going to hit Control A. Control C, and then you're going to click on this background and hit Control V, and then it's going to pop up. You can move it around, but this is a perfect size, so I don't, you don't really need to. So now once you have that, your background, you can go and you can find a picture that you like to put on that background. So since it's blue, I think... We're going to add, just because I can, I think we're going to add the, uh, hmm, what should we add? Let's just type in Pokemon. Yeah, let's see what we can find for Pokemon. We could do Squirtle. Or Bulbasaur. I'm not a Pokemon fan, so I don't really know. I just like, I just like Pokemon. Yeah, let's put Ash and Pikachu. Let's see if it's a PNG. Yeah, it is. Okay, perfect. So then you want to save that, and then when you go back to Pixlr, you want to go to File, Open Image, and then ah. Uh, Find the picture. Is some issue? No, 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 no. Shit. Where are you? Boom. There it is. Okay, so we control A. And then you control C, and then you click this, and then control V. Now this is a little big. So we're going to shrink this down, down to size, like that, and then we're going to put it like that, perfect, just like right there, okay? And once we have that there, we're going to go to flamingtext.com. Now this is a place where you can get text for free and you can download them and you can place them on your thumbnails or like an overlay on your video, whatever you want. And then, uh, we're gonna find a text. Text, uh, we're gonna find a text that we want. I don't really know. Glow. We're not, let's, let's get some glow text. Then you just wanna type in thumbnail tutorial.
crap. And then, that, then once we have that, once you have your uh, name, you want to go to background, and then you want to go to transparent. And once you have transparent, you want, once you have a transparent, you want to hit next, and then you want to download it. And then when it's downloaded, you want to go back to Pixlr, and then you want to go to open image, and then you want to go to your downloads, and it should be right there. And then you want to hit control A, control C, and then click this photo, and then hit control V. E. And then, if that's too small for your liking, basically the same with this, you can go up to edit, free transform, and then make it make it bigger like that yeah, that's a good size and then you can just go to file save and put it like that and I'm just going to change it so thumbnail tutor tutorial I'm going to name it and I'm going to hit ok and then I'm going to put that in my youtube stuff where I put all my things I'm gonna hit save and boom now you have your custom thumbnail and then once you upload when you're in your video but to upload it you can uh, put this here so yeah thanks for watching peace